everybody, in this video I want to talk about Canva and related items. First thing you want to do is go to canva.com and if you already have an account or you're signed up, you, this is what you're going to see. However, if you're not already signed up or have an account or are otherwise logged in, it's going to look something like this. You'll have an option to log in, top right, or sign up. And if you do need to sign up, you'll have different options. And for purposes of this class, yeah, you might already have access to this, or maybe you want that. However, the free version will be sufficient. And before you get into signing up, I do want to point you to a few items in assignment three. So if you scroll down, past the playlist, the video tutorial playlist, I have provided Canva resources. So there's the accessibility statement or information, and then there's the privacy information, privacy statement regarding Canva, and then support. So if you have any kind of questions or things you're wondering about, this would be the perfect place to look for that information. Okay, so regarding Canva, as I mentioned in the previous video, one of the things that marketers typically do is that they create marketing collaterals. So that would be just all the cool stuff that you see, uh, whether that's print ads, social media posts, whatever. And industry standard, so when I worked in industry, I typically used Adobe products. So that would be Adobe InDesign, Photoshop, Illustrator. However, Canva is just as good for that. And I know of many marketing departments and organizations who also supplement their Adobe work with this platform because it makes it really easy to just come up with amazing designs for whatever it is that you need to design. And so for this class and perhaps other marketing classes with me, we will be using Canva. So uh, now is as good a time as any, right, to learn about this stuff. And one more thing I'll say about this is that it is free if you choose the free version. And so that's one more thing we don't have to worry about. And then lastly, we're able to work off our web browser. And so you don't have to worry about administrative rights or managing software on your computer. And with that said, I'll go ahead and save this topic for the next video. And that would be brand consistency.